got seven pieces of mail from uh, some subscribers, so I'm going to go ahead and get started and we'll look, take a look and see what's inside. All right, first one here is from Bob's Coins. I went ahead and covered his mailing address up because um, it was a residential address. But uh, real quick, if you guys haven't subscribed to Bob's Coins, he's got a great channel. Um, Bob's Coins, got tons of videos. Uh, if you guys don't mind, definitely go subscribe to him, check him out. Like I said, he's got some giveaways. He just did a giveaway a month ago. Maybe he'll be doing a 200 subscriber giveaway. I'm not sure. But uh, definitely check him out. Show him some support. I um, believe this is a trade me and him did. Actually, there's no letter inside, Bob. All right. Um, so me and Bob did some trading. So he sent a I think, 2018 American Silver Eagle. Awesome. Some 40 percenters, super cool, and a the bald eagle copper round. Love it. I don't have one of these, so I'm a big fan of copper round. So I'll definitely put that in an airtight and add it to my collection. Definitely appreciate that, Bob. Um, like I said, if you guys haven't subscribed to Bob's Coins, definitely go check him out. Great dude. Um, like I said. Everybody in the coin community is great, so we'll set this off to the side and we'll get to the next one. Alright, the next package is from Rob Finds Treasures, which I sh shouldn't even have to do this. You guys all know Rob. Uh, great channel, great content, uh, super good guy to community. Um, does a lot of coin roll hunts, just does a lot of stuff. Just a super cool dude. Um, let's see what he sent. In there pretty tight. All right, it says congratulations, you have won something on my live stream. Um, I didn't win anything on this live stream though. This is just his typical paper that he sends out for people. Go ahead and pause this. It says thank you for everything, brother. Rob finds treasures. I know what this is. You guys are gonna like this. Check this out. Rob's certificate of authenticity. Guaranteed authentic and genuine three nines fine silver weight 1.8 ounces Troy serial number 19 the year 2018 RFT That is awesome my friend. I really like this pouch too. That's pretty sharp. Let's go ahead and look at this guys check out this bar Look at that That is beautiful Got Rob's stamp on it RFT established 2017 got the YouTube play button right there on top that is awesome look at that that is a beautiful bar beautiful 1.8 ounces Troy 3 nines fine silver bar number 19 that is awesome Rob man it's a beauty definitely I'll add that to uh all my custom poured silver bars from different channels. This is great. I'll keep this forever. Super awesome, guys. Like I said, if you haven't subscribed to Rob Finds Treasures, I'm sure everybody is. Uh, definitely go check him out. Subscribe to him. Like I said, I'm sure everybody is. Great dude. Super great to the community. Um, man, guy's always giving. So let's get on to the next package. Thanks again, Rob. Really appreciate that, my friend. This one here is from Rob Zunk. Um, Rob's got several family members that actually watch my YouTube videos. Great guy. Um, like I said, he don't have a channel as of right now, so I don't have a place to send you guys to check him out. But let's see what he sent. All right. Take this up and... Now let me get this opened up. All right. Rob, this is awesome. He sent us some foreign currency. I love foreign currency. I don't have very much of it. Pesos, $50. That is awesome. So 50 pesos, Mexico. That is awesome, my friend. I don't have any of this. This is a $2 bill from Jamaica. 
out of many one people. Awesome. I'll put these in some uh, plastic protectors. That is really cool. Thank you very much, buddy. This is China. There's a great wall of China right there on that. That is awesome. Yi Yon. I can't speak Chinese, but that is awesome, my friend. Thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. I greatly appreciate anything, guys, but this is really cool. Um, love foreign currency. Like I said, I don't have much at all. Um, got some Canadian uh, bills. Seduced by Silver sent me, and I uh, got some silver certificates that I got from a few other people. Um, this is awesome, my friend. Thank you so much. Um, greatly appreciate it. All right, we're going to go ahead and get to the next one so the video ain't super long. Thanks again, Robert. All right. Next mail call is from Lake House Beach. I'm sure most of you guys are subscribed to Lake House Beach. Uh, super good dude. But just in case you guys aren't, I definitely go check out his YouTube channel, Lake House Beach. Guy does a bunch of stuff. Really good dude to the community. Um, like I said, really just a all around good guy um, the other thing is is today's actually his birthday so if you guys don't mind um, show him some support go subscribe to him if you haven't already and uh, wish him a happy birthday let's see what he sent this card says thank you here is some more Lake House Beach swag I think this will look good on your safe talk to you later only a few people know these exist. Well, now there's going to be quite a few more. Oh, it's a magnet. That is awesome. Yeah, so he does unboxing, collecting, stacking, treasure hunting, and friend mail. That is an awesome magnet, my friend. Really cool. I need to get some magnets made up myself. Um, when I do, I'll definitely be sending you one out. Like I said, guys, definitely go check out Lake, Lake House Beach. Um... Super good dude, and again, today's his birthday, so uh, wish him a happy birthday, please. Alright, let's get to the next one. So next one's from my buddy Todd Miller. Todd Miller, another great guy. Um, Todd Miller actually has a YouTube channel also. Show it to you guys. Todd Miller, he's got 258 subscribers. If you guys haven't subscribed to him, definitely uh, go show him some love. Check him out. Really good guy. He comes to all my live streams, live silver pours. Um, always comments on my videos. Uh, super good guy. Actually one of my moderators. So let's go ahead and see what Mr. Todd sent. Um, I went ahead and put a post-it note over his address just because I don't know if he wants his address out there or not. Let me go ahead and open this real quick. Alright, let's check out his letter. Hello Quillman5000. Here is my logo channel sticker. For you my good sir and thank you for the stickers you sent to me they're awesome looking very nice so why do you want different ones i love all your videos please keep them coming have a wonderful night my friend thanks todd i really appreciate this so todd sent me some of his channel stickers these are really cool don't tread on me and just todd miller and then he's got a uh hobo nickel there it says todd miller youtube that is awesome, my friend. Thank you very much. So what Todd's talking about is... Um, I've got a couple different channel stickers. Oh, I just got two, actually. Um, Todd really likes this hobo nickel design here. Lake House Beach actually designed both of these for me. Um, I asked people on YouTube what they thought of this sticker. Half the people said they liked it. Half the, half the people said they didn't. Um, so I ended up going with this one here. I did get these made up. Um, I think I'm just going to keep both of them, um, order more of these, order more of these, and just use them both, like I said. Um, I didn't want this to seem, you know, demonic or anything for little kids or anything like that. Um, so that's why I was cho choosing not to use this as my logo, um, just for the people out there that, that might be offended or might find it offensive, you know, with kids and stuff, I don't know. But either way, I really appreciate it, Todd. I'm glad you like them both. Thank you very much for these stickers and the wonderful note. I greatly appreciate it, my friend. Go ahead and get on to the next one. You guys definitely go check out Todd Miller. Um, subscribe to him. All right, get to the next one. All right, next one I got is from 
East Coast Prospecting ECP. Went ahead and opened it. Um, I got the sticker here, kind of covering his address up, just in case he doesn't want that shown. So let's go ahead and show his sticker here. ECP, East Coast Prospecting. Looks like he's panning for gold there. Pretty cool. Got a Benjamin Franklin there. Got a Morgan, um, Morgan Silver Dollar. Really cool sticker. Really like that, man. I appreciate it. There was no note inside. Um, we're going to do a sticker trade. If you guys haven't subscribed to him, definitely go check out his channel. Show it to you here. Um, ECP, if you're looking for it, if you're going to search it, you got to search it like this. East Coast Prospecting Channel or uh, East Coast Prospecting ECP. Because there's a couple different ECPs that pop up. Um, I think there's one called East Coast Pistons and a few other ones. Um, definitely a good dude. He always watches my video um, comments in the comment section. So, um, fairly a newer channel, but he's got 225 subscribers. So, he's definitely moving up there. Definitely go show him some love, guys. I appreciate it. Um, ECP, love the sticker. I love any stickers. So, really cool. Appreciate that, my friend. We'll go ahead and get on to the next one. All right, this next package is from Elizabeth Gofert. Gofert. Um, so I went ahead and opened it up to see who it's from. So let me flip that down, and we'll see what's inside. All right, actually had quite a bit inside here. So let's go ahead and read this card here, see who it's from. Women 5000, thanks for all your giveaways and videos. I wanted to give back to you and or the channel in the envelope are coins for you or the giveaways. I also included a presidential coin that needs to be looked at under the scope as well as a World War One slash two German bullion bar. Tommy. Thanks Tommy. It's probably from Tommy R. I'm not 100% sure though. Um, let me know Tommy if that's you. Tommy R. Um, like I said it said Elizabeth on the the address, so I'm not 100% sure, but I think it's from Tommy R. Tommy always comments on my videos and stuff. Really good dude. I think that's him. I could be wrong, but uh, and I apologize, Tommy. You didn't put anything other than your first name. But let's go ahead and see what you sent here, my friend. It says, Souvenir of Loonsburg. Blue Nose, home of the Canadians' famous fishing and racing schnooner. I'm horrible at pronunciation, by the way. So that is pretty cool. Canadian 10 cents. 1989. Replica Blue Nose. Second launched July 24th, 1963. That is pretty cool. Details of Blue Nose and her replica Blue Nose 2. Cool. So it shows you the length of it. Um, where am I in the beam? Route. Displacement, tonnage, sail area. That is pretty cool. Pretty cool. Compliments of Hemelsman's Jewelers. Gotcha. Yeah, that is really cool. So we've got some stuff to add to the giveaway for sure. This here, I know what that is. That is a fake, um, it might even be gold plated. I'll have to look this up on Google and see. But it's a fake gold bar is what it is. Um, there's a lot of them out there. I actually looked at a few on eBay not too long ago. You can buy these for a couple bucks, but really cool. We'll definitely add that to the giveaway, my friend. That'll be neat for somebody. Really cool. Tommy, I definitely appreciate that. That is awesome. If you didn't say to give it away, I'd probably keep that one. That's really cool. I like things like that. Um, so we'll definitely add that to the Wheat Penny Giveaway video Friday. So, um, and he sent some Canadian quarters. Pretty cool. I don't have very many Canadian quarters, so I very well might keep these. Um, so I don't come across Canadian quarters very often at all, honestly. I might have one. So there's two of them there. Actually, there is three of them here. Looks like a 1982. This one is a 85 and a 2007. 
All right, put those off to the side. It's got some Canadian pennies here. 1974. That's a 2017 P Philadelphia. Um, I've got several of those, so I'll actually share that in a giveaway too for sure. Thank you very much, my friend. 1980 Canadian Penny. Canadian Pennies, I'm definitely going to keep those guys. I apologize. Just because I collect all the Canadian Pennies. 1977. There's another 2017 P. Um, if you're wondering what the significance about that is, is that's the only year that the Philadelphia Mint put a mint mark on the Lincoln Penny. So it's pretty neat, pretty significant, I guess you'd say. Um, there's a lot of them out there, so they're not like they're rare or nothing, but uh, really cool. I said it's the first year they did it. Um, and from what, what I'm told, they didn't really tell anybody they did it either. Um, they just did it and they went into circulation. So we'll definitely add those, my friend. Appreciate it. Got a Canadian dime here. 2011. Pretty cool. And this is a nickel. Canadian nickel. Um, sorry. So, 1988. Pretty nice, my friend. I appreciate this. This is awesome. Here's that. Oh, here's another Canadian penny. 2001. Sorry, my camera's having a hard time focusing. 77. All right. So this is the presidential coin you wanted me to look at under the scope. Seventh president, Andrew Jackson. Um, I already know what this is. This is actually a token. I've seen them before. Um, let's look at it under the scope real quick. All right, it's pretty worn on the back. Um, so the microscope, the coin microscope really isn't doing it any, any justice. Um, as far as how worn it is. Um, I recognize it because I've seen them before. I went ahead and looked it up off camera to go ahead and show you what it looks like. Um, actually what that is, Tommy, is it is a token, Shell's, Shell gas station token. And it says, Shell's Mr. President coin game. So here's what the front of it looks like. Seventh President Andrew Jackson. Sorry, this lighting is horrible. Um, 1829 to 1837. So, pretty cool. Um, still neat. Year, 1968. And this actually tells you about it. It's a promotional gas token. So when you filled up at the gas station, um, so whenever you filled up at a gas station at Shell Station, you received a paper packet which contained one of 39 different aluminum president coins. You then placed your coin in the matching space, provided the official game card, yada, yada, yada. Prizes ranged from $1 to $5,000. Um, pretty cool, though. Like I said, it's definitely got some age to it. 1968. So that's what it is. It's a uh, promotional gas token. But really cool. So I'll actually add it to the uh, Friday giveaway. So really cool. Tommy, I greatly appreciate this. Like I said, we're going to add this stuff to the coin giveaway. Um, like I said, I'm going to keep the Canadian pennies. Maybe keep one, maybe two of these Canadian quarters. The rest of this, though, I'm going to uh, we'll add in the Wheat Penny giveaway video Friday. And guys, that's pretty much it. I'm sorry the video is so long. Um, if you haven't subscribed to me already, please do that. Give the video a thumbs up and comment in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys think of all this stuff. Thanks a lot.